Hey beauties, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica Yick, the Dancing Avon Lady, and if you are on the quest to look for plumper, fuller, softer lips, then you need to watch this video. So let's do this. Today we have a new lip product, and you guys know how much I love my lip products. We have this gorgeously packaged FMG Glimmer Lip Plumper. Now I've heard a lot of things about this product, but I haven't tried it myself, so I figured it was due time for me to put my pucker to the test and try out this baby. So this product here is supposed to help volumize your lips instantly without stinging and without burning, which is really interesting. And uh, it's going to leave you with plumper, softer, fuller lips with a refreshing peppermint scent. Now, the scent, you guys know how much I love mint. It's supposed to help really just kind of wake you up and give you that hint of freshness. I have used multiple different mint lip products before. Always love them. They kind of like, when I'm in a rush in the morning, I need to wake up for a Zoom meeting something minty on my lips is to the rescue because it just like, whoo, good morning, Jess. So this one here, it's in the color of Brilliance and it's supposed to be a universally flattering shade. It's supposed to be non-sticky, creamy formula and has a smooth lip hugging texture. So it's supposed to have a glossy, buildable, sheer to medium finish that is supposed to instantly hydrate your lips. It is formulated with castor seed oil, which uh, provides that instant hydration, vitamin E, which gives the antioxidant and also it has something called Volulip. So I looked up what Volulip was because it has the TM beside it. So I was like, hmm, let's go check that baby out. Volulip, it's a trademark product by the company Sederma. And it's an act, according to the Prospector website, it says Volulip is an active substance containing a plant extract and a natural modified macrotine and mimetic peptide to plump its lips by hyaluronic acid acid synthesis. Oh my gosh, my tongue's getting tight already. It's supposed to provide improvements on the internal and superficial lip textures while visibly impacting the lip shape. It also provides increased to lip volume, hydration, softness, as well as anti-aging, anti-sagging effects. Cosmetically, this product is used in lip care and in makeup application. Great things, need to try it out. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm going to open this beauty up and I'm going to try it out. I'm gonna leave it for a few hours and then we're gonna to touch base again. I'm not gonna put any lipstick on it at this time. But let's first off open this up. There you go. And let's do a quick swatch. Yep, there's that minty scent. Oh, it's a really pretty color. Look at that. Oh has almost like a peachy color to it. Super pretty, it has a little bit of like shimmer. That's quite nice actually. All right, so let's try this on my lips. So here's my lip before, and let's give this a try and see how it affects the shape of my lips. I can smell that mint already. It's very silky. Ooh, it's a pretty color. It's very, very, very light. It's actually, I think a little bit lighter than my natural color, lip color. So it just gives it a little bit of oomph. But this is a really pretty, like, just glossy look. I can smell the mint. And they're absolutely right. I'm actually really surprised that there's no stinging. Because I've tried other lip plumping products before. And sometimes it just gives out a little, like, tingle on your lips. I don't really feel too much of a tingle right now. Ever so slight. All right, but here's my lips immediately after. It feels really great. I'm enjoying the scent of peppermint. I feel a little bit of a tingle. Yeah, I do feel a little bit of a tingle, but it's not like, oh my God, my lips are on fire or anything like that. Don't eat it. Not the best taste. The tingling built is kind of like the little bit of a tingle that you get when you eat like a chili pepper. <laughs> It's like a slow build. So I'm gonna let, let this leave for a bit and I'll be back in a bit and see what it does over the next course of about, let's say 45 minutes to an hour. See you again soon. All right, I'm about to pick up Jenna from school. It's been about 15 minutes. My lips have stopped tingling, absolutely stopped tingling. I can still smell just like a little bit of peppermint, although my nose might be getting used to it. But here are my lips about 15 minutes later. Okay, so it's now time, it's now 3.30, and I've had on the Glimmer Lip Plumper for about an hour and a half now. I no longer feel any of the tingling. It actually was really interesting. It kind of had like a, um, a bit of a progression. <laughs> there was a slow climb, and then it went away. 
Yeah, so by the time I went up to, to I think by the time I got to my daughter's school, I felt no, not much or no more tingling at all. My lips do feel nice and moist and moisturized, hydrated. Do I notice any plumping? I don't know, what do you think? Maybe a little bit here? Definitely the brilliance of it gives the illusion of plumper lips, so whether or not it actually plumpified my lips anymore, you be the judge. But I really do think it's a really, really pretty look, like a really pretty look. I like the shade of it because it is very flattering. And I like the fact that it's just like that little kiss of color. It makes for a really pretty, just shiny lip look if you're doing a slightly more dramatic eye. Overall, I enjoy this product. I like it. It smelled really nice. It felt pretty good. I mean, like I said, there was that little bit of a tingle and then it did climb for a minute. It went away after a while didn't bother me. It didn't hurt. It wasn't uncomfortable, so there wasn't any discomfort. It's just, it was there. That's all. It was just literally there. Now, if you have like a crack in your lip, you might want to be careful of whether or not to use it at that time. You might want to give your lips like more of a treatment with um, either the Sika lip balm or the vitamin C overnight treatment to really give your lips a good hydrating, like, um, like some, some time to heal too before using a lip plumper. But overall, I'm really happy with it. I think I'll be reaching for this whenever I want a more nude, natural lip look. It's very pretty and it has a lot of good things in it, like the castor seed oil, the vitamin E, and the volulip. I keep reading tulip, but volulip. So I think that all of that is all great things. So if you guys are interested in getting one, I will put a link in the description box below. And if you have any questions about becoming a beauty boss, make sure you do reach out or find me on my other channel, Passions Paycheck with Jessica Yick, and I'll be there to answer any questions that you may have. Subscribe for more videos and I'll see you in the next one. I love you guys. Bye.